du, Stefan, ska du också vara med på March for Science? When we were young, we used to march with these really great values attached to science and freedom and liberty and so on. And I think this is a continuation of the general principles of that march. It's still a march for more than just science, because science underpins so much of our lives. We've always used marches to make a point. So this is a good time to remind us ourselves about science, not just as scientists, but to make everybody st stop and pause and think about how science has brought them and brought all of us to where we are today. The scientific discoveries are only step one. Step two, and the most important step, is how do you access, how does everyone have access to those discoveries? So if we really want to improve the health of our nation or the wealth of our nation, we have to invest in science. And it's important for, for scientists and uh, people um, from the Medical Research Council, people from Caprisa, to stand up and say why science matters and why it's important that we should be here today. I'm here because we want to end AIDS and with science we can develop more treatment that can make sure that all people who are already HIV positive are virally suppressed and they don't transmit to other people and we want to make people's lives easy. We want to be active in what is happening in our lives. We want to participate in how we move forward. We want to contribute to science. We want to be also in the driving seat and be there with the scientists when they develop things. Bye-bye!